Do you think there is any logic in having a new language that is designed to make it easy for LLMs to code with and attributes, for example, better pattern matching or other things that might be the strength of LLMs? If so, what would these patterns be? To me, I don't think that optimizing for the LLM is the right thing to do at all. Because go back to what we were just talking about. The important thing is reading the code. Always has been, by the way. Code is read more often than it's written. AI has made it way easier to crank out the code than it ever has been. And I don't think we're going back to where we were. So writing the code is actually not the key thing to me. It's about reading it. And so what I care about with Mojo and with these new emerging systems that we're building is really a combination of two things. One is expressivity. And so can you express the full power of the hardware? Yes or no? If the answer is no, then you will never be able to get it. So JavaScript will never be a good way to write a CUDA kernel or a GPU kernel. It just will not because it can't express the things you need to express. No slight against it. It's a good system. But if that's the goal, then you have to be able to do that. Now, assembly code can express the full power of the hardware. And that's not what I'm advocating for. The other thing that goes with it is you need readability, right? And so you need this combination, this intersection between expressivity, so can you express the important thing, in our case, performance, and then can you understand the code? Can you build abstractions? Can you build in scalable systems? And that intersection, I think, is the key thing. And so this is where you take Python syntax, for example. Python's super easy to read. It's actually very standard. A lot of people know it. Let's embrace that. Let's go all in on that. That's a good thing.